Hello, my dear friends. Welcome back to Infigam. Today, in this video, we are going to solve one very interesting question from System of Equations. Given that a, b, c, and d are real numbers, then we have to prove that a, b, c, d is equal to 2004. So let's get started. As we have a, b, c, and d real numbers, we can write here a must be positive. B must be positive, C must be positive, and D also must be positive. Now we will begin with our first equation A equal to the square root of 45 minus a square root of 21 minus A. We will consider squaring both sides. Now a square root and a square will be cancelled out. We will write a square is equal to 45 minus a square root 21 minus a. After rearranging the terms, I can write the square root of 21 minus a will be equal to 45 minus a square. Now we will consider squaring once again. So I will write whole square, whole square. The square root and the square will be cancelled out. We will get 21 minus a equal to 45 minus a square whole square. Now we are going to use a minus b whole square formula in our RHS. So I can write 21 minus a. This is equal to 45 minus a square whole square or 21 minus a equal to 45 a square is 2025 plus a square whole square will give us a power 4 minus 2 times 45 is 90 a square. Take all the terms to RHS, we will get a power 4 minus 90 a square plus a plus 2025 minus 21 equal to 0 or I can write a power 4 minus 90 a square plus a plus 2025 minus 21 is 2004 equal to 0. Now if I will solve our second equation, I will get b power 4 minus 90 b square plus b plus 2004 equal to 0. So from these two equations, I can think about one quartic equation in x. x power 4 minus 90 x square plus x plus 2004 equal to 0. Here we will write two roots are confirmed a and b and the remaining two we will call suppose p and q. So using Vita's formula we can write a plus b plus p plus q will be equal to 0 as we have x cube or the coefficient of x cube is missing or 0. So we can write a plus b plus p plus q equal to 0. So from here one thing is confirmed that P will be negative and Q will be negative. Or we can write P plus Q value will be minus of A plus B. A is positive, B is positive. So P plus Q must be negative. This is sure. And product of roots if I will write then A, B, P and Q. This must be equal to 2004. This is very very important equation. I will call this is our equation number 1. And remember this quartic equation. We will use this equation little later also. Now I am solving our third equation. Third equation was C equal to square root of 45 minus a square root of 21 plus c. 
we will consider squaring both sides we will get c square is equal to 45 minus a square root 21 plus c after rearranging the terms i can write a square root 21 plus c this will be equal to 45 minus c square again we will square both sides we will get 21 plus c this is equal to 45 minus c square whole square now we will use a minus b whole square formula in rhs i can write 21 plus c this will be equal to 45 a square is 2025 plus c square whole square is c power 4 minus 90 times c square take all the terms to rhs i will write c power 4 minus 90 times c square minus c this time minus c and then 2025 minus 21 will give us the same plus 2004 only the difference is here we are getting minus sign and if i will solve our fourth equation we will get the same equation but with variable d this time minus 90 d square minus d plus 2004 equal to 0. Now we can think again one quartic equation in x, x power 4 minus 90 times x square minus x plus 2004 equal to 0. Let's say this is gx and the earlier quartic was fx. Now I will find out sum of roots and product of roots here also. So I can write, let me write here, x power 4 minus 90x square minus x plus 2004 equal to 0. Now two roots are confirmed, c and d. The remaining two roots will be, let us say m and n. Now I can write C plus D plus M plus N, this will be 0. And C times D times M times N, this must be equal to 2004. Again, I will say M plus N would be negative as C plus D is positive. C and D is positive, then C plus D is positive. M plus N would be negative. Now I will write fx the first quartic from first two equations if i will write x power 4 minus 90 x square plus x plus 2004 and second quartic is gx x power 4 minus 90 x square minus x plus 2004 if I will replace x with minus x, then we will get the same equation. Suppose I am checking here f of minus x, just replacing x by minus x, I will be getting gx. So point is, all the four roots, which are the roots of fx, if I will write here a, b, p and q, and all the four roots of gx would be only the sign change means I will write here minus a minus b minus p and minus q. And here roots were here it is written also c, d, m, and n. Let me write here c, d, m, and n. Now I will only equate. As we can see, minus p minus q, we can equate with c and d. So I will write here minus p equal to c and minus q equal to d. Minus p equal to c and minus q equal to d. Or I can write here p will be equal to minus c and q will be equal to minus d. Now I will write product equation for fx. If I can write 
a times b times p times q this was equal to 2004 now here i will replace p and q with minus c and minus d so i can write a times b times minus c times minus d this will be equal to 2004 minus times minus becomes plus we will get our required result a b c d equal to 200 this is our final result and hence proof i hope friends you will like this video thank you so very much for watching do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video good luck take care bye bye